here's my uh, latest trade. I had posted my M1917 uh, World War One rifle up on arms list for sale, and someone offered me this Springfield Armory Marine Corps operator pistol for it, and uh, I went ahead and took it. I'm not sure if I'll keep it yet or not, but I'll sell it or trade it, but it's a very nice looking gun, very nice feel to it. Um, I'm not always all that crazy about 1911s, I just don't like the way they, they come apart. But they're probably the most aesthetically pleasing looking handgun with the, uh, the single action trigger. And they're very, very slim. And it's a long, long barrel, very slim gun. So it's kind of nice looking. And this one has all the, you know, bells and whistles on it. Skeleton trigger and... Skeleton hammer and ambidextrous uh, safety and front slide serration and all that fun stuff. And that's not loaded, just to be clear. Uh, it comes with two seven round magazines. It's at least a bit to be desired, I would say, but is what it is. I was thinking it'd be kind of cool to put a, um, have the slide stop, the safety, the hammer, the beaver tail, the uh, mag release, and the magwell all to be stainless steel, and maybe put something like uh, those Valkyrie Dynamics skeletonized grips and uh, compensator on it, kind of give it that uh, Punisher movie. 1911 pistol look to it. We'll see. It would look nice, but I'm not sure I'm going to go through all that for this gun. Anyways, just thought I'd show this real quick.